Hello and welcome to QUTV News. I'm Kalen Lowry and today we have some very exciting news. Brenner Library will be hosting a very special event for all of the Quincy community to experience. Quincy University, home of Brenner Library, which will be the temporary home to the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum's traveling exhibit from Washington, D.C. Back in October, um, I was very lucky to submit a grant with Dr. Mauter, Dr. Winter Mauter, who is an emeritus faculty, and Rob Manning and several other of the faculty to receive a grant that will allow us to have the American Library Association and United States Holocaust Memorial Museum traveling exhibit come here to Quincy University and be hosted by Brenner Library. This exhibit is used to challenge the commonly used assumptions that Americans knew little and did nothing about the Nazi persecution. We will have to move around the furniture a little bit for the six weeks that the exhibit is here in the library. We'll be mostly here in the main room and then at the far end of the building where the large tables and some of those individual study tables are set up. So we'll be a little crowded during those six weeks, um, which will be October through December of 2026, but we're very excited to make that space available and to make this exhibit available to our community. We want to give special thanks to Michelle Kirkham, who helped with the grant, Dr. Wendell Marder, Dr. Robert Manning, and Dr. Rohan, who pre-planned for the exhibit, and letters of support from Dr. Todd Pettit, Superintendent of Quincy Public Schools, Mark McDowell, Quincy Notre Dame High School Principal, the Illinois Veterans Home, the Historical Society of Quincy and Adams County, and Polis, who provided proof of community support for QU and Brenner Library. That's all we have for you today. Thank you for watching QUTV News and have a great day.